Variety that rocks. 100.5. Cruise FM. Ten weeks! Ten! Ten weeks now into this 12-week program with Cut and Conquer Fitness, doing the nutrition and the meal plan, all on the, the road, the path. The journey to being in the Fort McMurray Firefighters Charities Association 2023 annual calendar. It's a mouthful. It's important though. That helps out five charities right here in our community. More concrete details on that are going to be coming. First of all, the photo shoot, which we now have booked. There's a date on the calendar now that I'm totally on the hook for. So late June is when we're actually going to be doing the photo shoot, which is kind of nice because I'm on week 10 of 12 in this fitness program. That gives me like three more weeks to actually fine tune things and, you know, keep working working at it, which is my total intention, even beyond that, trying to learn some life lessons here, eating better, get a little more fitness into my life. None of us are getting any younger, right? That is the whole point. And of course, to raise money for local charities. You might be asking, what happened to week nine? If you've been following along really closely, I didn't actually post an update video last week. Mea culpa, my apologies. Uh, now, excuses, excuses, but it's just a couple things kind of happened layered over one over the other. One is that I had some vehicle problems, had to put it into the shop. That was changing up my schedule and having to figure things out. And then last week, mid of last week, got the two lines on a rapid test, meaning that I had to broadcast from home, couldn't go out to the gym anymore, had to do some isolation, and uh, still doing the workouts from home. Point being, progress is still being made. And even though I was shaken up last week a little bit, didn't get that update video, was still working out, was still sticking to the meal plan. And uh, in total, a drum roll please. Uh, I'm very, very happy about this. 25-ish pounds down. There's another uh, weigh-in that I'm doing every two weeks that's coming this weekend. So I might have a little bit more concrete details. But I mean, my whole goal, my whole plan was like, I'd like to hit about the 200 pound mark. And that was a change of 40 plus pounds for me. I'm over the halfway mark to get to that goal. And I think we're gonna get pretty close to it by the time it's actual photo shoot time, which is fantastic. One thing that I noticed, one thing that was bugging me, and maybe you'll find that you've got a little body part or two that you fixate on just a little bit while you're thinking, maybe I should work on myself. It was this, the double chin. I'm paying way too much attention to a part of my body that makes me self-conscious right now. But even from the side, I used to be able to do this. And I would have like a frog chin. It would like come right out. and. I wasn't loving that so much. I realized just over the weekend, I'm like, hang on a minute, it seems to be gone, or it's going. That's fantastic, that's just part of the benefits, part of this journey, uh, learning how to be better, get good, uh, with thanks to the Fort McMurray Firefighters uh, Charities Association for setting this all up, as well as Cut and Conquer Fitness. So more updates are coming, and of course I'll keep you updated throughout June as we get closer to the photo shoot, and as my nerves and anxiety shoot through the roof, Cannot wait to be in those pages alongside the very fit and very fine Fort McMurray firefighters. Looking forward to it. Thank you guys.